know when you're with someone in a relationship for a long time and the natural progression in that relationship if both parties are agreeing is to get married you know and that's kind of what happened in our relationship with Anna you know we were together for you know three years this time last year was our three year wedding our three year anniversary as a couple you know and we just ended up start talking to Anna it's like why don't we take it you know we could be and next thing you know we kind of we ended up getting engaged and for the last year since we've been making these vlogs people have been asking us for an engagement story and we've never really told it because we always felt like it wasn't worthy enough or it wasn't good enough because you know I had just left university Anna had left university we had no money we were just kind of starting out and we had nothing and when you have nothing it's very hard to do something uh, great and thing about Anna one thing about Anna is that a lot of people don't know this but she's very she is very humble and although she comes from a family that were able to provide her for things that I can't provide for her and my family can't, never were able to provide those things for me therefore I've never been used to them but Anna kind of was and she dreamed always of having the perfect engagement and the huge wedding and all these different things and you know when it comes down to it I'm not actually I was never in a position to be able to sort of provide them for her and when we left university I really wanted to make the commitment I really want to make the commitment and spend the rest of my life with Anna because I'd never met anybody in my entire life that I've ever loved as much as I do for Anna I always felt in my heart from the day that I met her when I thought I couldn't have her that if I ever did get her I would definitely spend the rest of my life confirming that I love her and today is our one year since we got engaged and I just you know the ring Anna has on her finger and I know that we've never really talked about it and you can check it out but it's actually it's nothing special guys you know it's a Swarovski crystal ring because that's all I could really afford. I couldn't get her a big diamond. It's in the Tiffany setting thing and people got all confused because a Tiffany setting is not mean it's a Tiffany diamond and you know everyone was like, oh show us the ring, show us the ring and you know and Anna Anna accepted that. She accepted me for the fact that I was unable to provide her, you know, huge wealth and amazing big diamond rings and all those things and I, I, I wasn't in a position where I could offer her anything like that. But she took my ring and she wore it proudly and she's still wearing it proudly because she believes that it's my symbol of my love for her and it was all that I was actually uh, financially capable of providing you know and it's always bothered me that I was unable to actually give her a ring that uh, justified her or give her the proposal because it just turned into more of an agreement and that just sort of happens sometimes you know but I'm I'm a very romantic person and if I had all the money I would fly her to Paris and or down to Champs-Elysees or Arc de Triomphe or something real romantic and amazing like that but I just simply did not have any any ability to do that and I really wanted to and here we are a year later and I'm in a much better position and I always promised myself there was no way I was going to allow the wedding to take place without having a proper proposal without doing something super special for Anna and getting her something that was really worthy and you know I've been kind of like on the fly been sort of keeping an eye out for things and today is our it's the year a year after we got engaged and it's three months to the wedding and it's our four year wedding our four year anniversary of being together and I think today is the perfect day to finally give Anna the proposal that I think that she deserves so this is what I've managed to do. Today, the map pack is being released for Call of Duty. And Anna knows I want the map pack for Call of Duty. So, I came up with this idea that I would have to come over here to get credit because I don't use my Visa card on the PlayStation Network. So, I got my game card. I told her I had to come over here to get the, because I do it every time a map pack comes out, I gotta come over here and get the credit from GameStop or something like that. So, came over here, brought the bag with me, okay? I went to this jewelers because we were in there the other day looking at wedding rings and I managed to get her to tell me exactly what ring she's actually looking for which is this bad boy here I bought a ton and I'm talking about like a ton of roses um, white roses to be exact because they're the ones that she wants and I'm gonna try my best in all I've got 
to make the woman of my dreams know how much she means to me and how much I love her. Because this is it, like, this is, this is the relationship I always wanted and I want to be the person I've always wanted to be and I always have told her different romantic stories of other things that I've done but I've never been in a position to ever do anything for Anna. So Anna, because I love you, this is for you. Because Anna's in the shower and I have a limited time to do this, but I've got to de head all of these, all of these uh, roses, and then I'm going to get the petals and then make the petals into like a little love heart with a little trail. But I can't talk about it because I'm afraid of getting caught, so I just want to keep you guys up to speed. This is a super hard part because I have to actually turn on. See the flowers. <laughs> Take one. That's what I see this. What you gotta do to all of them. <laughs> Shh. Sketch. Oh my, this is actually a lot more work than I thought. To actually individually do this but <laughs> sure it'll be worth it oh my goodness have you guys ever done this before i don't, I don't know what i was thinking it'd be like you just like make it happen but uh <sighs> Love makes you do strange things. Okay, now, all the uh, roses are set up, but this is the thing, guys. This is what you need. This is called a misdirection because Anna probably knows that it is our four-year anniversary and that I would probably do something. So, I got this card, okay, to my wife to be. <laughs> and I'll write something nice and sweet and I'll give that to her now. And then for the rest of the day she won't be looking for something because she will think like oh my god that's so nice that he got me a card you know because yeah, I can if I do nothing then she'll know that something's up so this is my misdirection Aunt Nina know the way I love you hmm? and it's been four years together yeah got you a card but I forgot an envelope I thought I came with an envelope and oh I just realized God. that there was no envelope. But I thought there was an envelope with it. Because it was in plastic. But it, there was no envelope, so... I guess I forgot the envelope. No. But I love you. Thank you. I love you, You didn't forget. How could I ever forget? You bought it today! What? You bought it when you were engaged! <laughs> I was not! Yeah, you did! Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is probably the sunniest day this year. Like, it is just so hot. I'm so glad I have no hair. <laughs> On a day like today. Head into the popo box! The popo box! Popo box! Head into the popo, yo! Oh, I want a convertible, man. Tell Jonathan that we need to go to the beach after this, okay? Leave comments. Say, Dopus, if you didn't go to the beach, then I'm going to unsubscribe. Oh, the old unsubscribing, eh? Oh, I, I ought to do unsubscribe, guys. You know what I'll do? I will be really sad. Let, let's, let's take a moment and think about that. <laughs> He's driving with no hands. He's driving with no hands. He's a crazy man. We call him Joe Bus. He's a crazy man. We call him Joe Bus. Oh, you gotta Joe Bus. Pop the collar. Uh, pop the collar. Uh, uh. And I had no idea I got the card, guys. It was a trickster. It was a trickster. She thought I was going over to get a computer game, but she had no idea that I was getting the card. I didn't even question it. You did not even question it. Why are you sufficiently surprised? Yeah. I didn't expect that from you. What do you mean? You make it sound like I wouldn't remember that kind of a thing. I don't know. It's okay. I love you the way you are. Wait, 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 what do you mean? Boys remember things. Boys can be romantic at times. 
I thought it was an ultimate plan, like ultimate frisbee. Oh my god! Look what Jonathan got. Oh wow. Ho -ho! Yay! Thank you! I was just standing there paying for the petrol, and the guy in front of me, and I was like, I must have delayed. And he was like, There you go, sir. And I was like, Oh, yeah, and two of them, please. <laughs> mm. Mm, that's what you want on a sunny Sunday. Yeah. I'll wait for today's Friday. We're going to have a fun, a fun Friday. Sunny Sunday and a fun Friday. Mm. They don't melt now. Okay. Card number one. What? Crazy. Uh, Aww. Is actually singing a song. <laughs> Listen. Happy birthday, Albie! Yeah. <laughs> this is Dear Cena, it may not be your actual birthday, but congratulations on turning six months old. Aww. It's so cute. Like there's one for Cena and one for Albie. Like how cute is that? Oh my god. My friend Rebecca lives around here, by the way. <laughs> If you want to stalk my friend Rebecca. Okay, so ah, I love these. What are these? Yeah, the loofah dog. Hold on. We'll put it back in the envelope for you guys. Oh, Cena's gonna, gonna go love crazy. that. Ah, ah, ah. Let's see. Oh. That is the coolest. And you were only looking oh for it yesterday. Oh my god. In yesterday's vlog, you were saying to me, can I have a new she iPhone got, cover? It's got a cupcake. That is so perfect for me. Oh my god, that is so cool. I just think it's so funny. In yesterday's vlog, the one I'm yeah. uploading right now, I think, yeah. it actually said, you're actually, can no, I have no, an no, iPhone no, no, cover? No, 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 it was the last one. It was, was the it? one where and we I was getting like, air, no. <laughs> yeah, John was like, no. Oh, thank you so much. And it's the right phone and everything. How did you know that? <laughs> listen. <laughs> listen. 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 That. Did you understand that? Yeah? Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna take everything out. And then you can open. Where's your toy? Get the toy, Albie. Get the toy, Cena. Go on. Get the toy. There's a toy inside, silly. Where's the toy? Yeah, you got it, Albie. You almost got it. Get the toy. Get the toy. <laughs> She's trying to take away the bag, and he's trying to get, he knows. He's like, it's inside, you idiot. Let's see if we can convince Jonathan. Joe Fuss. You know the way it's our anniversary. No, not about that now. Well, I was just wondering <sighs> if we could go to the beach. Oh, oh, excuse you. Excuse you. They love the toy. Did they? Yeah. Nearly uploaded. Okay. Your back but is really sore. Then, oh, wait, you know what the best thing for backs is? <laughs> oh my god, I'm actually serious. I read this in a, in a newspaper, because you know the way I'm always here reading the newspaper. Apparently, a little R&R &R at the beach is the perfect thing for a, for a backache. And a headache and, and toothaches. Not today, folks. What? Tomorrow. Lena, it's already like 4 o'clock. Don't put on the face. It's already 4 o'clock. Oh. And it's our anniversary. I know it's our anniversary, Nene. But like... No! 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 We're going on a walk, he's going on a walk, he's going on a mother effing mother effing walk, he's going on a walk, he's going on a walk, he's going on a mother effing mother effing walk, he's Yo, Jovis, yo, yo Nina, yeah. yo LB, uh, and Cena. Hey. <laughs> I don't know, that's not rhyme anymore. I can't what? rap. What? You could have kept that going. 
Oh, I know, it's pretty good. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Going on the walkies with my family. Gonna go outside where it's nicely. Summertime is coming and I be adrifting. Cause I drove fast so and that's how I be lifting. Your spirits up with the vlog of these nail it time. We made it to the wire. They were dying for some drinking. I think she's actually sleeping in it now. <laughs> Aww. Look how far out the tide is like. I thought they might run out there. That would be uh, that would be annoying. I'm on Anna's vloggities. The old vloggities for me. Feels it's better um, audio with the wind though. I know there's no wind. Yeah, right now, yeah, yeah. The other one is better video. This is yeah. better audio. The other yeah. one is better glass, better f stop. But this has got a better audio. Okay, this is not good. Look, look, she's lying in it. I know. I think they come here more so to lie in it. Anna's posting the last of the invitations. Right, guys. I think we're going to do it later on. Oh, what's happening here? <laughs> Do you want to see Anna's super cool thing she got? Music Academy! Woo! 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 And I got a Happy Meal and she got something inside of it. What's, this? what's the treat, I wonder? I, I'm not going to open it yet. Oh, yeah, not, not so. That, that, that's your anniversary present. Thanks. To go with the car. <laughs> Love you. Oh, Love you. take the juices. Take the juices. Take the juices. Nice bag, lady. It came from my friend Natalie. Natalie Portman. Natalie. Natalie. Looks cool, though. <laughs> it's like a real sweet for you. Sweet potato. And I think she's an investigator or something because she found a bag. Hmm? What is it? <laughs> what is it? Seriously, do you guys know? Seriously, do you know? Seriously. Because it's probably nothing. It's probably nothing. <laughs> you're just an idiot. I'd say you're just an idiot. But if it was nothing, then why are you keeping it a secret? It's because funny. it's funny. What secrets? Do we don't. We don't have any secrets. When would I ever have time to make secrets, Nina? This morning when you went to get the card. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. To get the card. Yeah. Gee, trees. gee, man. Trees really make me allergic. To You're allergic to trees. Yeah. You're weird. What about the grass? Oh, it might be that too. I texted Anna's mom. I said we keep Anna on the phone. I'm going to try and put candles everywhere. And I'm gonna put the petals everywhere. And I'm gonna hope that these two go along with it and don't ruin everything. So, here we go. I'm kinda scared a little bit. Do you wanna see what I've done? Is that the kind of thing you'd like? Ooh! Oh, with everything she wanted. I'm sure you guys want to see the, uh, the old jewels, yeah. Let's just see if I can pop this open. I'm opening it the wrong way. There she is, there. That's private. What do you think, guys? Is it good? Okay, I'm gonna text Anna's mom. I'm gonna just tell Anna to come on down the stairs. Okay. Will you finish up and ask her to come down the stairs? And not to let the dogs in. Sitting room. Sent. Okay. Oh my goodness. To follow the trail. <laughs> See where it leads you.